Hello guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to Paris Car Show and today I'm going to show you the details of the new 408 which has the world premiere here on the Peugeot stand at the Paris Car Show. So I already filmed the grey one but I want to show you the details of the white model as well. So let's start from the front and I really love the fact that this grille is sort of like the integrated to the front bumper itself. Look at the attention to details here. We also have the new badge and 408 lettering as a tribute to the older models. And it looks really, really good. These are the lights. So look at those beautiful shape. And of course, iconic daytime running LEDs from Peugeot. And overall, great appearance on the road. Tell me in the comments, do you agree with me? Now, moving on to the side, this is where it gets interesting because this car is a fastback crossover SUV uh, you know a lot of elements of different vehicles in this one because look at this we have the long wheelbase the fastback silhouette and coupe style of the roof of course jacked up and uh, that makes it really unique on the market now let me show you those wheels as these are a bit different compared to the ones on the gray model that I filmed. So uh, this is the wheel, you see the new badge from Peugeot and let me show you the dimension of the tires 245 40 R20, that's the dimension. Of course very aerodynamic wheels and uh, yeah they really suit the car because you have the contrast between white and black and also the wheel arches. The plastic ones make it more robust now you will see a lot of new badges around the car for example look at this on the side and you will see it of course at the back as well the wing mirrors are in gloss black nice led indicators and this car also has the panoramic sunroof now let me go to the rear of the car and show you the details here because this is really impressive look at this I think my favorite angle is this one because it really looks beautiful. It will be an eye catcher on the road, that's for sure, especially with those beautiful 3D LED lights. You see the beautiful design and very slim, of course. To emphasize the width of the car, Peugeot decided to put this gloss black part here to connect the lights and uh, yeah, well, definitely makes it stand out. What is also interesting is that we have a very robust rear bumper. Look at this. And also one hidden thing here is the rear view camera. Look at this. So it is located on the bumper itself and not here as you would maybe expect. 408 lettering. You also get the gloss black parts on the sides. Of course, parking sensors and uh, yeah, well, that is it very clean design no fake exhaust or something like that now let me show you the trunk space of course electric tailgate and here we are greeted with a nice square shape also what you can do is you can have additional room here for your cables for example since of course this is a plug-in hybrid these are the hooks for your shopping bags and by pulling those here on the side uh, you can fold the seats and then you have really a lot of room so it's really a practical car and i will also show you the rear bench which has a lot of room because this car has the long wheelbase electric tailgate of course closes by itself one cool detail also is this the special glass surface and you see the gloss black finish on the window trim so i want to hear your thoughts how do you like the car now it's time to check out the interior of the car so once again you see here special badge and this is how it looks it is really nice it's not something that you see often in modern day cars because this car has the unique design of the interior itself of course yes it is very similar to the 308 but you know nothing similar on the market so i think that's really nice let me show you the details here you see the stitching that 
uh, is the same throughout the whole car so that's really nice for example you will see it on the dashboard as well as the middle section here and now we have a lot of light so maybe i will do another walk around to show you more details now okay look at this and it's full glory share your thoughts with me how do you like it look at this from this angle strong appearance on the road this will be so impressive to see especially since it has uh, like the unique appearance thanks to those lights and the design elements but yeah now it is time to show you the interior and i'm not going to go through all the details of the infotainment system because i already filmed the gray car and there i showed the infotainment system so you can watch that video as well but this car has the this is the gt hybrid we have the 3d i cockpit 10 inch one and also additional 10 inch screen here in the middle with the new infotainment system you also get this panel here where you can configure the things that you use the most so for example uh, if those are the features that you use the most you can put them here if there's something else you can also put it so you just go to application drawer and uh, you know you can put it I'll actually show you now how to do it so those are the features that you can put and for example let's say you don't use this that often just press it and now select any highlighted item to create a shortcut for example let's say you want the energy flow look at this now here we have the energy flow you can also configure the digital cockpit and change the views in order to do that press this when you press this you have a bunch of views available and also the 3d view for the gt version so that's really cool tell me in the comments how do you like it and also a lot of customization is available for example look at this you go to customization and now here you can customize the digital cockpit and the main touch screen you can also change the screen color for example and you also change the color of the whole layout here on the infotainment system so that's really nice and uh, that's pretty much it not going to go through all the details but you see that this is really impressive you can also slide this so that you cover the cup holders 12 volt power supply usb port and the gear selector for the automatic transmission and drive mode selector sport hybrid and electric are available so now let's check out the rear bench 2 meters 79 is the wheelbase large doors tinted windows in this model and just by looking at it you can see that there's really a lot of room a lot of space here and now off to the specs of the model in our video there we go this is the gt hybrid rechargeable 225 horsepower total price of the car is here this is the price in france and you see options of the model and the pricing for those options we can also check out the technical details 7.8 seconds to reach 100 top speed is 232 kilometers per hour and uh, 4 meters 68 69 that's the dimension of this car speaking about the powertrains plug-in hybrids and petrol those are the options so share your thoughts with me how do you like the car do subscribe to the channel thank you very much for watching this video and see you on the next one bye bye